أنا جو كو هاد لايا أفك ما دحوينها يدولة الصوماليا يرجع الوزارة ها وحنسود ويننا سكرتيري جنرال ك EAC أو أ إسبهاي سيجا إيست أفريكا أو تدبوا ودن كم يجيهن سومالي أنا أيربتو إني إني كوبيرتو وحن كفر أحسن نهاي إن ديليجيشن كا يو سكرتيري جنرال كو أيمان تنو يمدان أو بلوغي أسيدي سومالي أي أون نقول لهيد كم يد نقول لهيد هاد EAC وانسود ويننا ولالكي بيتر وان وده شقيننا إن شاء الله وحفي عم بنا نكيني دونا دتك سومالي ذا هي دولة دا سومالي ذا با أد بدو مهتنتي. Thank you very much. My name is Peter Mathuki, Secretary General to the East African Community. First of all, I'm very happy to be in Mogadishu. This is home. I'm happy to be at home here in Mogadishu in Somalia, joining my brothers and sisters in Somalia. I came here on the invitation of uh, His Excellency the President, uh, His Excellency Hassan Mahmoud, who came uh, to invite us, and I conveyed the decision of the heads of states of the East African community, presidents of other countries of East Africa, confirming that they are ready to receive Somalia as our full member of the East African community. And so I thank the President for appointing uh, a special envoy of the East African community who is here with me and he has already visited Arusha to find out uh, the steps that seems to be taken. And the first step was here, coming here, and I'm here um, representing the entire community. We have now started the discussion on the process or on the roadmap of admitting Somalia to become a full member of the East African community. And there's a very strong political goodwill coming from His Excellency the President and this entire delegation and cabinet and the team committed for Somalia to join the East African community. Somalia is an important country for East African community because we share the same culture, we share the same values. The people of Somalia are already in all the East African countries. They're in Kenya, they're in Tanzania, they're in Uganda. So it is natural for Somalia to join and become a full member of the East African community. The next stage, will be now forming groups, technical groups, which will be under the guidance of the special envoy to ensure that we do the verification. And verification is to ensure that whether the preparedness of Somalia to join the community, and then after that we shall negotiate to see at what point Somalia would want to join the community. And then thereafter, we shall now have Somalia now join the East African community as a full member. Already the president has directed that we must do this within the next 12 months, latest, which means we need to do it possibly earlier. And on my part, I'm committed. I know the Excellency Special Envoy is very committed. Okay. And we are going to work together to ensure that now Somalia, uh, in the, before the next 12 months, is a full member of the East African community. The people of Somalia will benefit from being the members of the East African community because they'll be able to move freely in any of the countries of East Africa to do business, but also to look for jobs and for opportunities. Secondly, Somalia will be able to provide gateway for all the goods coming from other countries to the rest of the world. And Somalia will be a key country where we shall be looking at using it as a gateway. Thirdly, we shall be able to work together in any of the challenges Somalia is facing, economic or security, to ensure that we all work together to make sure that uh, all the countries of East Africa remain peaceful and secure. And the fourth thing is to support all of us working to support Somalia and the people of Somalia and to embrace them as our brothers and sisters so that they can become economically very strong, they can come, become economically competitive in the world and they can be able now to use the wisdom because the Somali people are very enterprising, they are very business like people. We are going to learn a lot from them in terms of how we are going to, to move this country. So I think I'm happy to be here to be received in Mogadishu, to be received by His Excellency the President and his entire delegation, but also my assurance that we are going to work to ensure that Somalia becomes a full member in line with the directive by the heads of states who met in Arusha and made a decision that we should start the process. So I thank you very much, and I'm already feeling at home, 
I wish there will be more opportunities in the future for me to come and stay longer in Mongadishu. You uh, will. Because uh, this is basically home. Yes. <laughs> yeah. So thank you very much. Thank you.